Welcome back to another cooking episode with Gab. Today, we will be cooking this beautiful wabuk that was caught by my brother. And we are going to be making it kilowin. If you guys didn't know what kilowin is, it's with ginger, onion, with uh, calamansi, and, and it's like very known for the Filipinos. And one of my favorites too, especially my brother's favorite. And let's get started. So the first step is we need to cut our ingredients. We have ginger here, we have onions, and how I like cutting my ginger is I really like it thin, so like it's also for me like decoration for the food and it's also like like when I bite into the ginger it really helps like my throat and it really tastes good. Now we just finished cutting our ginger and our onions. So the next step is we are we are gonna squeeze our calamansi into our strainer. So First step is we cut the calamansi and then you get your strainer and then you just put it here together. So now we have all our ingredients in this mixing bowl. And I also chose spicy vinegar which we will be pouring one cup and then we will be pouring in this and then our calamansi with some pepper and some salt. Let's pour our spicy vinegar in this one cup. Here we are with our spicy vinegar. We're gonna pour it into the strainer to get out all the chilies out. Make sure you aim. Wait for the chilies to get out and to get make sure to get all the juice out of it here to get that flavor. And the next step is we pour our calamansi. Make sure to pour it all around to get all the flavor. And a little salt the action. There you go. And then also a little, a little black pepper action. I really like putting a lot of pepper because I like mine really spicy. Our spices and ingredients are all ready. Now the next step is we will cut the fish into cubes and put it in the bowl with some vinegar to take out all the germs and massage it. We got all the fillets ready. Now we're gonna make this beautiful fish in the cubes. And I already like doing this. And so for the final step, now we have all our fish in the cubes. So now we will put vinegar and salt. Now we will mix it, then right after we will put one tablespoon of salt. Then mix it. And after two minutes, we will get like some pieces and squeeze it lightly to get all the juices out. Two minutes has gone by. Now we will getting some we'll put some fish in our hands. Right after that, we'll squeeze it really light to get all the juice out. And then right after, we will put it here in our bowl that has all the spices and all the ingredients. Almost done. This smells amazing and it looks amazing. Now, we will mix all of the our spices with the fish to get all the flavor. Oops, I spilled. But don't worry if you spill, just keep on going. Make sure you guys mix it well, so the flavor of the, all the spices and the ingredients will go everywhere. Okay. I can smell the ginger, the onions, the flavors is just going everywhere, it smells so good. Now, if you guys want to plate it, this is how I do it. So, get a spoon and then just put it all there. and. Another tip is you put it in the middle 
And this is how we show it to like our guests and how we serve it. So put it, make sure to put it all in the middle. Grab some tissue paper, wipe the the watermarks or the food marks there. And now for the final part, the taste test. I'm here with June, Yaya Faye, my favorite cook, and they are about to taste what I need. Wow, kung masarap yun na. Ah, sarap, galing, galing. I guess I passed the test. Thank you guys for watching. Please don't forget to like and subscribe and hit that notification bell. Comment down below if you guys have any ideas or, or videos that you want us to do. And stay tuned for more videos like these. See you next time. Peace!